So here is a video of the camp. It's a staged scene. So they're going to come up to the crest and then one guy's going to bring the flag to say what? That we're here and we're planting our flag. So here's the one guy. So he's calling him forward. There he comes. There's another guy. Right? And planted. That's me in the white. Person, the um, first wow, I'm surprised this is on here. Okay, so you're gonna. This is my my training of them. Safety is gonna be on. When you're done. You're going to do this, remember how many shots we're firing, and we'll do the exact same thing. And we were the youngest here, I mean the kids? So yeah, the youngest was uh, 14 years old. And um, I told him, you're not going to fire. He was the only guy that did not fire. And he's lucky I said that to him. Because in court, when they asked me, did everyone fire? I said, one guy did not fire, and it was that young offender. How do you know? Because I told him not to. Why? Because I thought, man, this kid is here. He has no idea what's happening. You know, so, you know, people will, they blame me, but uh, seven people got off of their charges because of my sympathetic testimony. So it's not like I wanted to throw everyone in prison. I mean, there were young kids who were there. Who, they didn't know what the purpose of the camp was. They were tricked by the, the ringleaders. Now, they don't know that there's a massive investigation going on behind them. They think they're going into the woods and playing, you know, G.I. Jihadi. And you think a lot of kids are now tricked into going into Syria, or is that too naive? I mean, um, I think they are already naive. Uh, the kids are naive. They think what they're seeing, they, these are heroes, right? The Nasheeds are playing and it makes it sound so nice and they want to be a part of that. Especially for a young boy, uh, he, wants to be, he wants to be a hero. And even in our own Western societies, we treat our militaries like heroes. So what militaries do they have that they can relate to, that they can say, oh, these are my heroes? And that's what you have. You have a deficit of heroes in the Muslim world. And so you have terrorism disguised as heroism. Yeah,